What is going on everyone and welcome back to more Black Desert. So today is a pretty big day for all of you on NA and EU. Uh, we finally get the central market. This is my first time logging in since the maintenance. We got triple icons. That's pretty sweet. Um, so yeah, today we're just going to look at the new central market. I assume that's what everyone is going to be doing. Um, so yeah, I, I knew this was coming. But I don't really know exactly how it works. I was trying to like skim the patch notes this morning before doing anything. And it was actually mentally exhausting reading the patch notes. Like they list every single thing. And anyway, new central market. This is what we're going to be looking at today. Um, I think I have a general idea of how it works. But in terms of detail, um, the way it works is basically you from your storages in town... I believe you you can dump money into here, and then you buy stuff from that. It's kind of weird, but okay. Um, so, I'm just going to figure out how it works. Um, let me see. Do I have any money on me? Let me just... Oh, okay. Let me just... It also... Um, weight or silver doesn't have a weight limit anymore so you can carry up to a hundred million at any time so that's pretty cool let's uh let me see do we have, oh, oh sweet thank you guys again once uh for all the gifts you guys are awesome uh, i know the event's over but uh i just wanted to say thanks for all of you who sent it back And I assume a lot of other streamers did that, too. Alrighty, let me see. Let me just send these back real quick. Also, the fact that you can't really copy-paste without holding shift and arrow keying it is probably one of the dumbest things. Alrighty, sweet. Ah! Also, these are kind of useless now. Um, apparently, you go to Adventure Log, which you can hotkey somewhere. Uh, this is what I did. Just go to Edit Menu, and then, like, whatever. The Adventure Log is right here, and hotkey it. If you're on the old menu, um... I'm not actually sure how to change... Oh, yeah, you go to this one. And then your Adventure Log should be... Dude, I have no idea where it is. Ever since they changed to the new one, I've been, I've just been using the new one. Adventure log. Dude, what? I feel like this is just more confusing than... I don't know. Well, I use this one, so... We're currently on book 10, so that's pretty sweet. Um, there's only 10 books right now. So this is what I've been doing. This one is going to be the stupid, tedious one for me. Um, two evasion. Uh, it's worth it. But man, getting all the knowledge of creatures in Medaya. Oh, God. Uh, defeat the Skeleton King. This one is doing 10 of those forbidden books, which is expensive. Uh, kill 20 of something easy. Um, and then this one is just a grind. So that's cool. Like, I'm on book 10 right now. Uh. Anyway. What did I just get? Did we get a... We got a fill stock box. Hey! 20 stack. Alright, so new market price items. Um, let me. Current market. So VT is the equivalent of weight, I believe. But for market. That's what. I don't understand, but. 
I kind of like how they had the marketplace information color coded back then, but I guess now it's not. Yeah, I mean, it's not a big deal, but I just kind of like how it's color coded. Whoa, the market for Tet Nuvers is lower. I mean, it's going to go up. This is just day one of the market, so prices are going to go skyrocketing in a few days, but... Alright, let's, um... Oh yeah, I wanted to test something. Um... Let's... Let's take out one million, and... Where does this mo oh. It's pretty Okay, so in terms of the warehouse, you take money from your inventory and then you deposit it into your warehouse or your central market. Okay, and then let me see. I'm Ooh, you can list stuff directly from your storage now. That's pretty sweet. Mm, what is something I would actually sell? Everything is at like an all-time low right now, so I'm kind of hesitant to sell anything because I'm pretty sure I can make more. But... This doesn't even have a market price yet. Oh, it does. Okay. Um. Uh, let's test what flax. Items listed at nine oh five. What does this mean? Uh, if I want. Oh, so this is like how much they're listing for. Okay, that makes sense. So basically, this is how much if you want to buy it. Uh, obviously, if you're a buyer, you're going to want to buy it at the lowest price possible. Okay. So this is my warehouse total price. Do you get taxed? Oh. Okay, so the tax is still in place as usual. That's it's fine. All right, so pearl item sell. Wait, did they raised it? Oh my god, I need twenty five hundred fame for it to be increased. So on the patch notes, the default before it used to be five. Oh, you guys, you guys, yeah, you guys, you guys can see it. So before, uh, you can only sell five pearl items on the market. You know, whatever. That's if people want to do that. And then they increased it. Like, every 500, you can sell five more up to 30, which is kind of a little shady. But, you know, if you're going to... I don't know. I kind of wish that wasn't there, but it is. You are, you are still searching for a dark rift. A dark rift will open within seven days. These are actually pretty fun to do. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> I enjoy doing them and getting the rewards. Anyway, back to the central market. Um, volatile price items. Is this like um? Okay, let me see. Let's look at the important stuff. Obviously, keep in mind this is day one, so things are gonna be a little bit different. Uh, so there's a registration count. All 
Oh, so this means you can see how many people are... Items listed? Does that mean there's one for sale or one order on it? I'm not 100% sure what that meant. Or does registration count mean, like, you know, the total number of transactions in a lifetime? If you sell a pen weapon for that much right now, just know you're an idiot, so don't do that. Just wait for it to go up. <laughs> um... Wait, hold on. Oh, God. Favorites is still there. Thank God, dude. Uh... I don't remember what the default price was. Wasn't this like 400 something mil? Like 450 as of the four central market. So everything's at an all time low. Yeah, this starts at min price. These are, these were 880 market price, but then pre-orders are like 15 billion. Okay, so everything's at min price right now. All right, let me see. Let's look at something that I know is listed. Um, first of all, why are you selling? Why are people selling these at min price? What are you doing? Okay, so let me see how this actually works in terms of what is status. Oh, okay, status is just. Um. Oh, so they kept a total number of trades from previous markets. That's cool. Okay. So, items listed. So then, if I were to want to buy one, can I just pick the price I want to buy one? Obviously, lowest price. And then, I just buy one? Okay, I don't particularly want a Blackstone, but okay, let's see. Let me see. Pearl items, they increased the price of it. I gotta see. Holy, what is this? Yeah, today is not a good day to be selling. <laughs> Wait for the people who who just need instant money first. Alrighty, um, magic crystals. What if... Oh, God. This makes it look stupid. Okay. So, let me just uh, test this with a cheap item. If I wanted to buy something... I could buy it for any price that has something listed, I assume, yeah? Alright, so let's buy the lowest one. I just want one. Manage warehouse. And then, do I just withdraw it from... Oh, okay. Oh, 
You know what to do with this. Just grind that. Grind the crystal, lady. I've got nine blackstone powders. Okay, so that's... We figured out how to buy and sell stuff. How many... Is there a limit to how many things I can list? I don't... I kind of wish you could hide this, though, especially... Well, I mean, it's not really a big deal. I kind of wish you could hide it, especially if you were, like, a streamer or something. Or a YouTuber. It doesn't really affect me, but, like, if someone's trying to pre-order something, or, like, order something big, you don't really want to show that. But, ultimately, it doesn't really affect me. Uh, what else is there? Alchemy stones, destruction... Alchemy stones have been sold out, like, permanently, because there's so many people with the, uh, concentrated magic for Vels, and they still need the powder, so they're just grinding it up. I want a Vels heart. Dude, it's 3 AP. Huh. Oh, dang, you can see how many orders are on. <laughs> Dude, what? I don't really understand. Like, if it's a valuable item such as a Vel's Heart, why would you order it for anything but max price? If you want the highest chance to win it, like, whoever has an order on this, this, anything but the top one, just take your order down and relist it at max price. That's just how it works in video games, unfortunately. Unless that's like someone sells it for like this much flat, do you get this price? Or does it still go to top bidder? I don't ultimately understand that yet. Time will tell. Um. All right, let's go. Let's go see the ogre prices. Does that mean total trades today or like what is what is this line even? Or is this like my personal <laughs> it's a good one. This guy is sneaky. I I am actually curious. Ooh. No one has I'm pretty sure people have twenty two bill, it's just no one's gonna list a pen ogre. That's why there are no orders in it. I'm pretty sure people do have the money. Ted Ogres. If you can get one for 11 bill, that's actually really good. Dude, if you won a Tri Ogre for t like min price that 1.8, I would actually be upset because I paid six billion for mine. Yeah, can't say I'm surprised with that. So you can only order thir plus 13 and above. Everything else is just first come, first serve, buy. Kind of like, you know, just buy face. And then everything else is an order on it. $6.8 billion for a pen dandy. If I sold it yesterday, I would get like... 8 billion out of it after pre-order, but you know, you shouldn't be selling a pen weapon anyway. 
So. Oh, now with the orders, you can see, like, which is the most popular class. But I think we already know that's uh, Striker, Mystic, Wizard, Witch. So, let's look at the important classes for pens. Oh. There's less orders on a pen guard brace. That's surprising. Oh, yeah, people are ordering tets and then smashing it. That makes sense. What I'm really wondering is how often the marketplace goes up for prices like things like this. Oh, dang. Dude, I'm so glad I have mine. I got mine off to Nightbender a while ago. And it's, I think it's at Duo, but it was at Ted at one point. Then realized that I probably wasn't going to play Witch for a while. I still am not really sure what this is, but whatever. Does this, is this like a special deals thing? I'm not sure. So, wait, hold on. So with this said, do, are the notifications gone? There's no way to get notified when things go up. Let me... Okay, so does this even exist anymore? Because um, I know I had items on uh, notification previously. I assume this is going to be gone in about 30 days. They just want to let people, like, retrieve all their items, and then that's it. Alright, so one other thing I wanted to check. Manage my warehouse. So I can withdraw and deposit freely, right? So let me put 15300 in here. And then I can deposit... Wait, am I getting taxed out of that? Hold on. We're doing this for science. It's only like one million silver. Don't freak out. Oh, I thought I got taxed out of that. <laughs> I just had to double check. Alright, we're good. Um, so, yeah, I think the notifications for, you know how when you wanted to get notified when something got listed, I think those are gone now. That one looks the coolest. Huh. Alrighty. I still do have an often box. I don't know which class to open it on. So, if I were to, like, put the extra often box on anything, it'd probably be the Striker Mystic one. But, once again, I can't afford to be enhancing right now. And then, of course, we already have ours on our Dark Knight. Is there a way to see how many have been sold, like, today? Or when the last time one was sold? I still don't know what the hell this means. What is this line right here? I wish I knew when the last item was sold. 
<laughs> there are no orders on a plus eight. Laverdos are still at like an all time low. So, how would I buy something like at a plus seven? Um, because I know zero to seven just goes on buy now, I think. Oh, it's considered. Zero. Okay, that makes sense. What happens if, like... I wish I knew how many were, like... It doesn't tell you what... What if I want, like, a plus four? How do I know how? what are these listed as, like... Hold on, let me just check something. Does this change? Or did it change, like, the items listed? It automatically gives you one at, like, a plus six? I think I read that somewhere. Um, so, zero to seven. Basically, it's 100% to enhance it, so it doesn't really matter. But, like, if you bought one at a certain enchant level... <coughs> It just adds the price to that in terms of like the Blackstone weapon, and then if you buy one, it'll give you whatever. So that's I think that's kind of cool. Uh, if it worked like that, um, dude, if I had a pen Liberto, I would. Probably still use that over a Tet often. <laughs> I'm not gonna enhance one myself. Oof, yikes. One thing I do want to look at is whom. Dear God, dude. I'm not getting the hooms anytime soon. Uh, let me go to another market where I have more money. We can test out the order system. Feels so smooth right now. And again, it's like after maintenance. This one has more money in the store. Ooh. I 
not really sure why they decided to have money in like storage versus just the same way it's always been used, but you know, whatever. Let's take out 50 mil. Can I access the central market from Oh, you can deposit. Neat. All right, you can deposit from your storage. Well, uh, dump 51 mil in there. Okay, so let's see. Let's actually test the order system. Let me see, 26, and if I, Sharps are sold out as usual. You can only buy. Oh, you can only buy the max amount you have. Okay. Well, that's cool. Can I order another Hooms if I wanted to? Or. Oh, uh, so you can still only pre-order one. And then mine is at the chance of me actually getting this is at like stupidly low chance but you know whatever if it goes through it goes through um what other things do i want Everyone who sieges uses this in Node Wars. I wonder what Grim Reaper elixirs are under. I'm still not sure what this is, but okay. Um. Gonna need the market to fluctuate. Holy, these are expensive for a die, dude. Oh my god. So let's say I wanted these. I assume once we click it, it's gonna be like tens of that. Oh god, dude. Okay, so let's put a order on this. I want 
five of them. And this is max price. Oh, that's cool. You can set orders on a lot of things. I wonder how many you can order. These are mostly just testing. I don't actually think I'll get them, but... If I do, that's great. Anyway, with that said, I am going to wrap it up. I think we got the general idea of how this central market worked for the most part. And uh, I'll see you guys in a bit. Thanks so much for watching.